Well, it seems to me if, if you're a Christian, then you believe that the world uh, exists because of the overflow of love and joy within the Trinity. Mm, wonderful. The Father, the Son, and the Spirit create the world from the overflow of, of love and joy. And I think that gives you um, an incredible framework for experiencing things that reflect beauty in this world, music being one example. Yeah. Because you can see this, you can see different things in creation that are beautiful as a, a faint reflection of God's glory and goodness. And I like to use metaphors. So I've used the metaphor of if you're a naturalist and you think that nature is all there is, then music is kind of like an opiate to a dying person. Mm -hmm. It's something that is, it's, you're glad you have it. But you're glad insofar as it's a distraction from reality because reality is not beautiful or um, meaningful ultimately. It's very chaotic. Yeah. Um, on the other hand, if a trinity spawned the world, then you can look at music and see it uh, more like a window to an imprisoned man. So um, it's a little clue of something that's out there beyond our ability to fully take in. And that's how I like to think of music as a Christian. And, I love uh, The Silmarillion by J.R.R. Tolkien, where yeah. he's explaining the creation of the world, and he does it in terms of music. You know, the angels of that realm are making music, and in one sentence it says that as their harmony goes out into the void, um, it was not void. Wow. And the music is what produces the world. And then you have that verse in Job about the angels singing for joy at the creation. And uh, I think this is not an argument for God, really, but I would see it more as um, one way in which having God as a sort of framework for how you approach life um, does make a difference in everyday experience. And you're able to look at that beautiful strand of music and say, this is not a distraction from what ultimate reality really is like. This is a little clue of uh, what ultimate reality really is like, and that is beautiful, harmonious, meaningful. And I find that more satisfying and I find it more plausible as well.